Hi, I wrote a poem for my nephew and my daughter, Jason and Amy, and every other son or daughter or mother or father who puts themselves in harm's way to keep us free. It's titled Real Heroes. Now, hero is a word we often hear, but I don't think we hold it dear enough to understand what it really means. We wave it around like a flag, pass it out like a rag for people doing what used to just be the right thing to do. Because somewhere on down the road, we lost ideals about who was right and what was real, and we forgot all about who we are. We are the U.S. of A. We stand tall and proud. We are free people, and we are allowed to speak our minds no matter what. Because of that, I can stand here and say who the real heroes are. We hear it every day. Army, Navy, Coast Guard, Air Force, Marines. The men and women who are seldom seen because they live far away in some foreign regime who's trying hard to send them all home in a box. Your sons, my daughters, someone's mom and dad, they volunteered. They were glad to pack up and go defend our rights. To enjoy our lives and not live in fear, these are the things that we hold dear. Now somebody's trying to take it all away. So next time you see one of this country's finest, pull out your hero flag and shout the loudest. Show them this is the proudest country this world has ever seen. Shake their hand and tell them thanks. Let them know you know a real hero, someone who should be forever proud. Because they heard that old bugle call. They mustered up. They stood tall. They came when their uncle called. Now, if that's not a hero, I'll tell you, friend, you had better prepare because we are near the end. You can't forget the ones who'll die to keep us free. So tip your hat and clap your hands. Let them know you love and understand. It's a small price to pay someone who's a real hero. It's a small price to pay someone who's a real hero. Thank you.